Because, like, who's actually going to, like, be like, oh, yeah, I've thought about killing somebody. Right. You know? mm-hmm. I think like I think at it's least a good, like, step. Yeah. Step mm-hmm. like, I think so. It's a hard yeah. question, but yeah. we gotta yeah, ask. Like, it. Oh, have you been feeling consistently sad mm-hmm. and stuff like that, or like? Yeah, you know. But I think if like asking the question, if you ever felt like killing somebody, like someone has actually thought about that, you know, and like has felt guilty about thinking about that, if they got asked that by somebody, you know, like you and I or where any of us would be like, no, you know, never. But like yeah. someone that's actually been like thinking about it, like I feel like they'd be like, oh. Yes, you know. Mm-hmm. Like they'll take, I, they'll take a step, like yeah. step back, like oh. Like, yes, I, I have. have I think I have a help. problem, you know. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And they can get the help they need. Mm-hmm. If they are, I don't know, if they're not yeah. some sociopath, I guess, right? That wants to do. And I know in Asian culture, like family reputation and the name is like more important than, like, esp- like if one of your family member is like, I don't know, has schizophrenia or like some mental illness, then it's like hush, like keep quiet and. <laughs> then you don't ruin the family's like um yeah reputation so um because status is kind of important in asian culture um but uh so there's another topic i want to go into um so you know throughout the semester we always try to find like the benefits to meeting new people um and now I want to bring it back to, you know, we talked about that 1% chance of something happening. Nine, nine, 99% chance it's, they're good people. But that 1% chance is like a realistic. And what I think we did. Something happening. Like, you're right. Mm-hmm. You so actual threats, okay. um, dangers from meeting new people, like they might actually be. Be someone bad. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, what do you guys do? What do you guys do to keep yourself safe? And um, I like for me, like I just don't really think about the dangers, but I should. I mean, in my back of mind, yeah, I do, but I just go out and just like talk to new people. Like, yeah. But I know, like, especially women, the girls in this class, like, they can't really have that mindset. They have to like keep themselves keep like guard up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, I think there's like cues, you know, like social cues, like if. I actually just read about on Wikipedia. I love Wikipedia. I read about this guy that that would bring meet people, like he'd meet other guys and bring them back to his house, it's like hook up or something, and then he'd kill them. You know, mm-hmm. and he had killed like sixteen people doing this. And Jeffrey Dahmer. I don't know his name actually. It might have been that, but uh, uh, and then one of the guys he brought to his house, this guy who was like his account. I read his whole account. And he's like, yeah, I, I just kind of got some weird vibes, but like I was like, he was really charismatic, you know. Mm-hmm. So he ended up going back to his house with him, and while he was there, there was like a really bad smell throughout the whole house, and there was like, like blood stains, and he he left and called the cops, and it turns out the guy had a bunch of bodies in his freezer and shit. So mm-hmm. the thing is, like, you know, no one would know those things off just like a conversation, you know. So like, if you're super, cr- you know, you and I, are, you know, we're talking, and I'm I'm the killer guy, and I'm super charismatic. Like, there's no way you would know, you right? Know, mm-hmm. Until you start seeing cues. So <laughs> right. It's not like you have that guard up in the front of your mind, but like in the back of your mind, you gotta be kind of analyzing. Right. You know these little things that might. Action. Right. Yeah. Exactly. Do you guys remember the three rules, like the most important rules I um, taught you guys? Three rules of engagement. I don't think I. I don't think you were like there at that yeah. time, but I remember. I I, I, I post on the I learn, um, but do you guys remember number one? I know one of them is like be open to rejection or something like that, right? Be open to rejection, right? That's number three. Surrounding. Right, so um, that's number one, situational awareness. So uh, that's also coming back to that point is being aware of your situation, um, whether it's other people or like your environment. Like, um, it does he look, I mean, like you try not to like categorize people, but at the same time, like it's also for your personal safety um if he's like you know very like anti-social um maybe some gestures that are not very welcoming um um make sure also i like to look at people's hands when i talk with them or like when they're nearby me because you pretty much their hands is their most like dangerous part of the body um they could be holding knife or a gun or like like some type of weapon or a net or something. I brought a knife into my job and I was going to like stab people. 
Mm. I mean, I wasn't there, because it's fine. But it was like my mom and like my mom's coworkers were there, and like they got like really scared. They called the cops. Like they had like the cops like speed dial at my job, basically, because like it's like a dangerous. Mm-hmm. Mm. I'm also like always like actually like whenever I like with people like you guys, I'm actually like right now um, being aware of your hands. Like I, if you try to punch me, I, I. I'm aware, like, yeah, like, yeah. ah! I'm aware of my legs, though. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> I'm like, ah! I did not look at it. Yeah, legs is like, on a, uh. Okay. Uh, like, you can't really hold a gun with your legs or a knife with your legs, right? You can get a pretty good kick in there, but... You can get a good kick yeah. <laughs> I've been kicked pretty hard before. So, um, what do you guys do? Like, do you practice self-defense? Do you carry a... Uh, what's that called? Spray? Like pepper spray? Uh, pocket knife. Pocket knife? Mm-hmm. <laughs> what? No, I'm just kidding. I, I, I have it with me right now. Oh, yeah? Uh, no, I don't think I have weapons on campus. Can you? I think you have a pocket knife. Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, that's a, hey, that's really, that's really smart of you because yeah, it's perfectly legal and it's... Yeah, because I, you know, mm-hmm. I get kind of scared yeah, at night to mm-hmm. walk around. <laughs> I'd probably just cry. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, you know, like. But would you actually use it if you need to use it? Yeah, I would use it. Mm-hmm. Like in like fight or. I also like, carry something, yeah. but I don't. Yeah, I prefer like, not to show. Like a deer, like um, show it. Um. Probably gonna. Because I would most definitely cry if something happened. Yeah, I bought my girlfriend yeah, a yeah, pepper spray because like, like she has to walk from like, 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 work like, to like a parking lot. Like, I, I don't even give a shit, a like, I know the threat's so minimal, like, but why even risk it, you know? I don't care anything, though. I carry these. I carry these. You know what? I don't care anything because I try, I, I like, want to have my, I think I have, like, a like a pretty well-kept situational awareness, you know what I'm saying? I was like, oh my god, I don't want to die today. Yeah, there's scary people out there. Do we know her? I don't know. Did you know her? I don't know. I know, right? You knew her. <laughs> you dog. I probably know her. Are you ever Crystal? Now? I think she just want to be to be part of our gang. You know what I mean? <laughs> I come back. What about like, like what you're wearing right now? Um, for example, um, could you be able to um, climb over a fence if you? Um, had to. Uh, yeah. Thing, yeah. <laughs> like, you know, right? Off, I fire, can. Wait, maybe I can. Somebody. I can. Like a sweater but always gets caught up. With you can just grab too. it so easy. Like hood, just you get stuck on a maybe fence. Yeah, yeah. 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 Like, maybe I can hop a fence. I, I mean, think like, if, I can't hop I think if anyone's getting like, chased by like, like a pack of wild dogs or something, you know, like we can all definitely jump a fence. You know, that fear gets in you. fit would be Grace because she's wearing running shoes. Yeah, I know, right? She's prepared to run. <laughs> you, have to, you have to ditch your backpack. Like, yeah. yeah. You have to be like, toss it. It's, what is it? Throw it at the dogs, you know, and... Flight. Flight or fight. I don't doubt my backpack and let it go. Like, do high knees. You run faster with high knees. <laughs> really? Yeah. In track, you're taught to, like, cut it. Mm-hmm. You know, right. More power when you, like, release. I'm really out of shape, so I'd probably be, like, the first one to die, and y'all can escape while I... Aww. I'll take, yeah, you don't I'll take you up for that. You can't be the slowest, you know? I'm like, I'll take one for the team, y'all. It's okay. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> How good are you guys at, like, I mean, for example, you said dog bite, I guess. Um, uh, or, like, maybe knife attack. Is your clothes enough to, like, prevent, no. like, pe- no. skin penetration? No. Like, I think this one is. I think my backpack is my laptop. <laughs> I always think about that all the time. If somebody came to school with a gun or something like that, I would, like, kind of like use my backpack as like a shield you know oh, so it'll like, i wonder it'll like, it'll the laptop's still right here. It, but, it'll like, but i would attack definitely like i'd grab like a desk and like throw it or something something yeah. like that tackle yeah, once again, i would just cry because like, i just freaked like, out like, no. i think your phone is pretty good too like protecting from bullets and kicking yeah. like, kicking i think it'll be fine too. just like at least have some space distance like special distance I no, because like, I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> not, not, not here. <laughs> like, okay, I got shot. Phone. phone saved me. <laughs> Buy me a new phone. I don't know how to explain that. I'm like, you just did. Yeah. Like, my phone got shot. <laughs> <laughs> my phone got shot, but I didn't. Know. <laughs> this is a YouTube channel. I kind of like watch. It's kind of weird, but like, it's called Active Self Protection or something. Um, active Self, like, yeah. And then these are like 
it's, he shows like a video of the incident that happened and then uh, what people do to defend themselves or the mistakes that they did. Um, I like the watch says, even though it's no one like scenarios. scenarios that that mm-hmm. um, like, you know, 99% of the time you're going to be fine, but that 1%, it, it's ac- maybe actually realistic um, that could happen. Because, um, you know, we hear about school shootings a lot and um, they're just, they don't. Also, I want to ask, um, are you more in danger of people you know or people you don't know? People you know. People you know. Yeah. Like 90% mm-hmm. of homicides are by people you know. Right. Mm-hmm. Isn't that weird? Like, yeah. Because you can, I can't really. Because at one point, maybe you hurt their feelings exactly. and they took it like. <laughs> no, exactly. Like, you know, exactly. Like, I, I, there's a way very bigger chance of me offending or hurting someone I know than me right. offending or hurting a stranger. Mm-hmm. It's like that one movie. Um, it has Adam Sandler in it where he has to go back to like elementary school or whatever. Yeah. I can't remember what's it called. Yeah, um, uh, Billy Madison. Yeah, that one. Where like he apologized to this guy and he like crossed his name off like his hit list. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. I remember that. Cause like he bullied him when he was little and he's like, uh, hey, I just want to apologize for apologizing you back yeah. then. So he crossed his name off the hit list and he's like, the next guy and he like fucking like shot over. Right. <laughs> mm-hmm. Doesn't he like end up saving his life in the end of the yes. movie too? Yes. <laughs> yeah, because like he goes and he's like shoots him, he's like yeah. lipstick on him. And he crosses out a name, right? And then he's like, I'm glad I called that guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so um, I want you guys to remember rule number one. What's that? Situation awareness. Situation awareness. That's like at least the minimal thing you could do. Um, ah! <laughs> so. Go like that kick behind their legs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so um yeah that's at least one thing you gals through this class situation awareness do you guys remember number two eliminate expectations good eliminate expectations number three be be open to rejection you I, I think everyone's somewhat afraid but just be open to it ah <laughs> I want to test you all day I know right <laughs> Um, have you guys taken self defense or anything? Or? I think you won last. Try grabbing my hand. Cheerio. I know a trick. Oh my what? goodness. <laughs> <laughs> that was like magic. I It felt like it went grab through my hand. hand Wait, Grabbed your other hand? Yeah. Yeah. Like, oh, okay. Grab, so, like, grab. when I took a self, like, I remember my friend took a self defense class. She told me, like, when someone grabs you, like, the only opening really is, like, your thumb. You mm-hmm. know, like, naturally, here. I'm gonna grab you and try to pull away. Like you're yeah. trying to pull away okay. this way. But so like I have to go to. The way is to go like that. Okay. Oh. So like you can slip away out. From the thumb. Oh, right. He like did teach me another way if your other hand was caught. Let me see. I think you just like pull. Yeah, yeah that's pretty much. Like, try pull, like gripping really hard. I don't, I'm okay, not, go, like, go. I'm, I'm not weak. Go. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you're right. And then that's pretty. Like, ah. Yeah, because the thumb. That's that's actually really interesting. Because the no. thumb is like the breaking point. Yeah, you're supposed right? to go like this, and then because your arms are up. Okay, I'll throw good. Yeah. Um, that's Thank good. You. Take, Thank you for teaching us. Yeah. I think it's important. <laughs> um, I like to go to the rock climbing wall on Fridays and just like practice climbing. Like, for I'm gonna meet you there now. I mean, okay, so the best type of defense is literally running away. That's yeah. the best you could do. Like, um, and if you had to, if you're you know at a dead end, you know, cornered, then you gotta have to. Then you do, then you do active self protection, self defense. Get raged. So yes, attack. yes, the fight or flight. Mm-hmm. Um, so it helps to be, you know, pretty quick running. Uh, <laughs> or climbing, either one. Can't climb either oh man, okay. Climbing. Or uh, or digging your way out, <laughs> or flying or something. I I don't, or I taking a boat, swimming. Dig like nobody's business, guys. <laughs> <laughs> or when they're just about to grab you, you can death in a ball and they can trip over you. But I think that's just or like you can cartoon. flip them over. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm not good. I'll just tackle them. Also, like, if you get in the car, get in the car and you could, like, use that car to drive away or something. Or, um, I can't drive over. Or, yeah, I guess, yeah. Um, Run them over? Wow. So, at the... You never want to ditch your car, but if you have to, you're going to have to fight for your life or whatever. So... All right, uh, what do you guys want to do? Do you, so the challenge, I mean, 
it was pretty repetitive, but work on your final project <laughs> until, because it's due next week, right? Awesome. So, <laughs> you're like... What about our uh, end of the year party? Yeah, so, uh, next, um, we're gonna meet at the Humanities 381, I think. Uh, and we bring snacks, right? Yeah. Oh, I'll bring snacks. Should we? I'll just bring an email and hey, can you shoot an email or yeah, email? have oh, people sign up what they want to bring. Tuesday like extra credit if you bring a snack. Tuesday. Okay, <laughs> I'll do it. Tuesday night extra I'll credit. Be work and I can definitely just pick up a bunch of shit before I come in. So oh. extra credit would be great. I'll bring juice. I called it. Juice. And <laughs> better be good juice. I'll bring some kind of guys like free sun. Free sun. I was thinking like Arizona. Ooh. Arizona. Arizona. Yeah, that's fine. Yes. I'm down with anything really. Yeah. I'm so a okay, and uh, if you're doing a, <laughs> make sure you guys are doing um, your group like meeting up or something, and only I'm, I don't want to say this, but uh, if you really have to, you can turn in a paper, but um, that's the last resort. If we need to. Sure, okay. mm -hmm. but let's all avoid powerpoints if we can. Okay. Um, but Good. last resort, PowerPoints and paper, that's what fine. What if you brought a friend? <laughs> no. no. It'd be nice to could join the party and everything. Yeah. But um, I want right. to know what you guys like. Oh, yeah. How much things you've learned, like, actually, like, did this class actually, like, change anything? Yeah. Like, did you can get to meet new like people? tutorial like, videos of all the techniques? That's that good. That yeah, you can do that, too. That would be cool. So, <laughs> we just have to be able to like get our schedules down to like where we can find a time to like meet or something. Mm -hmm. You guys all working together or something? Or? Yeah. We're trying, but I think like right now is a good time. Yeah, After take it right now. I mean, you gotta go exam. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. everyone else, like, okay. try to do it. Like, we meeting back here at what, 40? Right. No, I think we'll just end. Okay. Um, okay. And anytime, probably. Okay. Yeah. So. All right, well, I'll see you guys all next oh, yeah. week. Oh, yeah, so work on your journals. Like, get yes. something. I, will, man, I, gotta catch up. I can do Friday. Friday? Okay, Friday. Uh, bye, guys. Bye. Do you want to be part of our group, too? Who? Chris? Uh, do you want Sina? to be part of our video? I got something going already. Oh, you do? Okay, okay I, I see you. All right, then. All right. All right, see you. Did you get my message yesterday? Yeah, um, brother and sister, something like that. Um, yeah, I'll probably go. Uh, on the 14th or something? Yes. 12th? <laughs> 14th. I'll probably be. Alright, guys. I'm gonna go get Alright. Wait, do you want to like, talk about the time that we can get? Okay. I will. I will give you a time. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 Or like, do you work I don't. I I'm pretty busy this week. Oh, really? In several weeks, actually. What about Saturday if we have to? I could. You can't do Saturday? Oh, really? You can't do? What about you, Grace? She's finished.